everyone. It's Thursday. This is the last day of our week. We have off tomorrow. You all did amazing this week. I'm so proud of you. I'm so excited I got to see you yesterday and today. You're all doing amazing. It's story time. We're going to read. Stand back, said the elephant. I'm going to sneeze. Look, look at the picture. Look at the zebra's face. Look at the bear's face. Look at everyone running away. Could this sneeze be that bad? Do you think he's actually going to sneeze? What will it do? Let's find out. Stand back, said the elephant. I'm going to sneeze. I hate to alarm you, but I don't wish to harm you. My friends, I fear. It's clear. Oh, dear. You better stand back. I'm going to sneeze. Oh no, oh no, cried the buffalo. You're so big and strong. Your trunk is so long. Your sneezes send everyone flying along, bumping and thumping down pathway and trail, bouncing and jouncing head over tail, tumbling and bumbling. Your sneeze is a gale or a hurricane. I hate to complain, but please don't sneeze. Look at how scared that buffalo is. No, no, please don't sneeze, cried the monkeys in the trees. You make such a breeze when you sneeze. The last time you blew us right out of the trees. The branches began to bend and to sway, and some of us landed so far away. We didn't get back until the next day. After the whole day. The leaves all went whirling and tumbling and swirling, and the flowers shook for hours the last time you sneezed. Even a cough would knock us knock some of us off. Oh, please, don't sneeze. Oh, look at the poor elephant trying so hard. With a shriek, the parrot opened his beak. The elephant says he's going to sneeze. Oh, elephant, please, cried the birds in the trees. The last time you sneezed, we lost every feather. We didn't know whether we'd ever get back together. Every parakeet was bare as a sheet from his head to his feet. What's more, all the whales had peacock's tails and the wings of the cockatoo were stuck on the kangaroo. That's a silly picture. You must confess it was quite a mess, very confusing and not too amusing. Even a snuffle makes our feathers ruffle. Oh, please, don't sneeze. Everyone is so worried about him sneezing. Fly, fly, called the birds to the bees. The elephant says he's going to sneeze. <gasps> oh, no, buzzed the bees. Not a sneeze, not a sneeze. The last time he blew off our stings as well as our wings, and we had to make do with roses, rose thorns, and glue. Furthermore, what a shock. We all had to walk on our knees, if you please, and that's hard on a bee's knees. While our rings grew back in, what a sin. Oh, please, don't sneeze. Beware, beware, called the bees to the bear. The elephant says he's going to sneeze. Oh, please, not a sneeze, cried the bear. That's not fair, I declare. The last time you sneezed, he blew off all my hair and left me so bare. I spent the whole winter in long underwear. Nothing so sad as a bear, bear that is bare. The poor giraffe, don't laugh, almost bent in half, and the crocodile snout was turned inside out. The last time he sneezed, a sniff or a snuff is bad enough, but a sneeze, oh please, don't sneeze. I suppose you could hold your nose or wait a while, asked the crocodile with a sad little smile. Oh my, don't try, said the fly. We wish, said the fish, you would if you could, the last time you blew off all of our scales, from our heads to our tails, and our gills got the chills. Our skin was so thin, and if you do it again, we'll freeze. Oh please, don't sneeze. The zebra yelled, yipes, you'll blow off my stripes. 
lots of flocks and lots of the leopard spots, and all of the snakes will be tied up in knots. The hippopotamus said a lot of us will fall right on our bottomus if you sneeze. So please, don't sneeze. Everyone doesn't want this sneeze. I'm sorry, my friends, said the elephant sadly. About all of this, I do feel badly. If I could keep from sneezing, I'll do it gladly. But I have a such, I had such a twitch in my trunk and an itch, plus a bit of a tickle and even a prickle. You must run, fly, and hop. I'm afraid I can't stop. I would if I could, but there's nothing to do. Ah! Ah! Boo! shouted a little gray mouse, jumping out of his house. He stood right up on his little tiptoes, stuck out his tongue, and wiggled his nose. Eek! shouted the elephant, jumping in the air. That's a mouse! That's a mouse standing there! I must hide in a tree before he gets me, or jump in the lake, for goodness sake. Don't scare me! Please spare me! The elephant is afraid of the mouse. <laughs> the mouse laughed. Oh, poo! Now what could I do? A little thing like me to a big thing like you. I only wanted to you to give you a scare, and it worked as sure as you're standing there. Elephant, think about it, sneeze. He completely forgot to sneeze. Well, what do you know, cried the elephant. That's so. It's astounding, confounding, as I live and breathe. I don't think I really have to sneeze. He began to giggle. He, he, he. That's the funniest thing that has happened to me. Ha, 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 ho, ho, ho. The elephant shook from his head to his toe. He ho ho and ha ha He giggled and guffawed. He chortled and chuckled until his knees buckled. He sat down and rolled from side to side. In fact, the elephant laughed till he cried. He laughed till the ground was shivering and shaking, and all of the trees were quivering and quaking. The monkeys came tumbling out of the trees, and the stings fell off every one of the bees. The bird's feathers went flying to God knows where, and all of the hair fell off of the bear. He's a bear bear. Bear means nothing is there. The giraffe bent in half, and the crocodile's snout turned inside out. The fish lost their scales from their head to their tails. It's a mess that's happening. Oh, no. The zebra yelled, yikes, there go my stripes, while the hippo went thump right on his plump. You know what? And into a puddle, the mouse went kerplop. Then he sat up and shouted, this simply must stop. We're terribly glad you don't have to sneeze, but if you must laugh, laugh softly. Oh, elephant, please. A fun book. Even though the elephant was able to hold back his sneeze thanks to the mouse, everyone still lost everything because he makes such a big noise. Well, I loved reading that and I love reading to all of you. I hope you have a wonderful break because we have off next week. I'll miss you very much as I do already now and I will see you when we get back. Bye everyone. Have a great break.